wisdom, because this is what we can, we never lived, and there never was an age in which worldly wisdom was as uh, it as it is. Of course, the Grecians, I know, but they were just as some chosen men, Plato, Aristotle, some of the key figures. But I mean the masses, there never was a time when the wisdom of this world was so flaunted before people as it is now. And yet, in, the, in that text, I first read, it says the wisdom of this world is foolishness with God. Amen. If any man would be wise in this, he would let him become a fool and, and, and the world's wisdom that he might be wise. Amen. And that's what we can find with. That's what's keeping people away from God. They're so enamored of earthly thinking and earthly reasoning. And when you try to reason them on the basis of God's word, which is the only, only way that we can reason God, well, it's foolishness to them. The natural man will see not the things of the Spirit of God because it's foolishness to there's, there's a conflict. You cannot be, uh, in order to be wise in this world and at the same time wise with God. Because they're, 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 